Sveicināt atpakaļ Optibet Hokeja līgas fināla sērijā. Otrā sērija spēle var aizsākties. Un iepriekšējā spēle bija diezgan interesanta. Maz vārtu gumbi, bet abas komandas bija savstarpēji ļoti līdzīgas. Zemgale manvadītā komandu uzvarēja pirmo sērijas spēlē rezultātu 2 pret 1. Sīvā cīņā uzvarot Kurbada komandu. Kurbats vienīgos vārtus gūst skailas kajā vairākumā, kas bija arī viņu vienīgais skailas vairākums tajā spēlē. Bet redzēsim, kā tad izvērtīsies šī spēle vai Kurbadam izdosies izlīdzināt rezultātu sērijā vai arī Zemgale dubultos savu pārsvaru un pietvosies vēl tuvāk Optibet Hokeja līgas titulam. Atgādināt šīs sērijas spēles es nekomentēju, bet došu savu viedokli pēc spēles un arī mazliet pārunāšu pirms spēles. Tā kā tiekamies jau pavisam drīz pēc spēles beigana. Grukovic has got the puck through the neutral zone. 
The Zephyr scooping up along the boards. Moves inside and just gets a piece of that one to keep it out. And that's blocked in traffic. Now into the offensive zone from the right side. Moves it to the middle. Here in the late going to the frame, it's 2-1. Face off here in the neutral zone and we are back underway. Tries to feed it across. Kippersoff swooping in on the attack. Puck exits the zone. With possession along the wall. Pops it up for the goal, and the rookie is on the board! What a nice way to jump into your first playoff year. You get on the board, and you can relax a bit. He got clear in the low slot, found where the opening was, and takes that pass to one time it past the goalie. Play set to resume with the face-off ready to go. The knockouts win it. A little burst of speed now as the puck's moved inside the offensive zone. Look out! Oh, what a save in front! Baha runs, had to be sharp. A shot from dead center. Nice zone entry from the middle. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Moves the puck behind the net. And that's out of reach and out of the offensive zone. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. Along the half wall with the puck. Back to the point it goes. Oh, and he stops that one that was served up with a whole lot of spice. Kish has won it off the faceoff. People excited as this opening period comes to an end. One of the all-time great rock acts from the 80s getting set to play here for these fans. And we'll catch our breath back to Portugal. Both teams had a chance to recharge. And the officials set to drop the puck here on period number two. Second frame is underway as the puck is dropped. Shot! Stopped by the goaltender. He got a little piece of that one. And he takes the feed. From behind the net now, he scoops up the puck. Picking up some steam at center ice. Shot! Stops him with the glove! And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. We're still in the early stages of this period. It's a 3-1 hockey game. Lots of offense already. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. Tries to get the puck over to Yekimov. And he takes the pass. Scooped up along the wall by Burakovsky. Feeds the puck across to Miller. The Zephyrs take it along the wall. Takes the feed at the point. The knockouts move it ahead. And now he moves it to Yekimov. Takes the shot. Some last second communication with the D as centers get ready to drop the puck. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. And that pass doesn't go. Manages to hang on. Oh, they probably want to redo on that. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Grabs it in his own end. They go on the attack from the left side. 
moves it to the middle. And he denies that great opportunity there. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame. The knockouts make their way back into the face-off circle, still in search of another goal. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Devastating hit into the wall, and Vicky tried to turn him into drywall on that play. The Zephyrs gain control of the puck against the wall. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Slides the puck down low. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Takes a shot. Up to the challenge as he gets his pad on it. Moves the puck. And now he tries to get it across to Gaskins. Down the right side and into the zone. The Zephyrs will play it against the wall. And that's off target as it hits a body. Grabs the puck here in the neutral zone. Connect on the pass. Takes the pass. From center, they get into the attacking area. The Zephyrs have it against the wall. Looking dangerous as they move along the boards. Play developed. It's a two on one. Scores his second of the game. Now, here's a little math for you, James. One's good, two's better. He finishes off this opportunity, and now it's a great night. They really moved the puck well on the odd man rush, and now they find the exposed player, and that puck is in the back of the net. That's perfectly played. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Puck is dropped, and play resumes. Oh, he had the right idea, but couldn't make that play with the pass. Plays the body into that play. Straight up the middle. Here they come. And a little body contact on that play. Hammers a shot. And that's blocked away. Oh, and a misfire as that goes right out of the zone. Nice feed. Behind the net, looking for the transition game. Nice zone entry from the right side. On the attack along the boards. Handles the puck. Takes a shot. Oh, quick save. The knockouts move the puck in the defensive zone. Steps into the offensive end. Here's the chance to set up now. And a huge stop by the goaltender at point blank range. And it banks off a stick in traffic. Handles the pass. Takes the feet at the back end. My goodness, the pressure really building here in the offensive end. Oh, what a save! From off the half wall. And there's the whistle as the goaltender will hang on for a much needed stoppage. Late goings of this period. 4 2 is the score. is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. The Zephyrs cross the line and gain the zone. Skates in behind the cage. Whoa! Scores! That's back-to-back, -back, Ray. Well, the, the game has changed. Those two goals here really have changed the outlook. Sweet down low play here. I mean, the shooter gets into position close to the net. That's a gorgeous little feed through the traffic, through the feet, onto the tape, and it's in the cage. Officials ready to drop the puck and get things back underway. The knockouts win possession here in the open ice. Drives to the crease. Stopped by the goaltender. That's a really good save. I think the goalie's probably surprised. He was dead center and open to shoot that puck. The Zephyrs played along the wing. 
tried to connect the pass, but it doesn't go. Gains the zone through the middle. And he regains control of the puck. Good fight for the puck along the boards. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. The Zephyrs played along the boards. And a good smack with the stick to get it down. Steps inside. The Zephyrs have it now. Receives the pass. Gaining momentum along the wing. And he takes the feed. That brings period number two to an end. Uh, the ice resurfacers coming out onto the ice. They'll give it a little cleaning, and I can see Ray Ferraro down there between the benches tap dancing. I can only imagine where he needs to go. Been a great night for hockey so far. He's Ray Ferraro. I'm James Sabalski. Let's drop the puck on this third period. It has been a thorough dismantling through the first 40 minutes. Let's see if they can try to change that here in the third. Here's a short pass to Burakovsky. From one point man to another. And he shut the door on that last play. Oh, wow, stops the game. There's the whistle, the goal hangs on. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. The Zephyrs lead it 5-2. Burakovsky's won the face-off deep inside the offensive zone. And he had the answer on that play. Nice speed at center, moves up ahead now. Grabs the puck. Quick pass to Kippersov. The Zephyrs look to start the transition game. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Cutting to the front of the net, he scores! Off the defender and into the net! This puck changes directions pretty significantly here as it bounces off the defender and goes in. The centers are lined up and we are ready to resume. And there's a little help from your friends right there from off the wing coming up with the puck. And now it's over to Vic. Good stand-up hit on the play. Here's a pass in front. Takes the blast. How did he stop that one? Penalty coming up as the play's blown dead. A little bit of a careless play with the stick and the trippy call is made. our first opportunity to get a glance at the special teams unit. You can set a special team trend if your first power play is a positive one. Get some shots, get some pressure. Puck picked up by Olaf. Oh, and it's just wide of the net, no play on. He's going to shake his head when he sees this because he's, he's in as good a scoring spot as you're going to get to all night. And he just misses the net. Moves it around along the half wall. Grabs the puck and moves on out here at this man advantage. Here they come through center and into the offensive end. Flips it up the net. And they got caught up in traffic and hits a stick. The knockouts gain possession. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Takes the puck as the clock ticks down on the penalty kill. Gets it out of his own end. The knockout's man advantage is over. Well, the only thing that happened on that power play was the clock rolled along. Very few chances, not much danger. The Zephyrs have it now. Fires it, and that goes off a body. Grabs the puck in the corner. Cuts into the paint. Denies him in close. Smothered that in close chance. The centerman glide into position. Here's 
Oh, and he takes possession of the puck from off the wing with the centers all locked up there off the draw. Puck set across the blue line. Pass back to the point. Quick feed to Kiblenics. Takes the feed. Here's a chance. Scores! Oh, man, it is past the stats night at one end of the ice, and I think the fans here, Ray, have about had enough. Well, if you're not sure, just listen for the next 10 seconds. Man, they are all over the home club here. It's been a rotten night, and they're not going to be shy anymore about letting the players know what they think. get a hold of the puck off the draw. And that's offside, stopping the play. The Zephyrs win the faceoff. Into the offensive end, right up the middle. Comes up with the stop. Moves the puck along the half wall. From the opposite point. Fantastic save! Under siege and finally grabs that one and covers up for a whistle. The Zephyrs win the faceoff. Puts it on net. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. Takes a slap shot from the point. And that's blocked from someone in front. Slides it back to the blue line. Moves it quickly over to Burakovsky. Moves it to Gaskins. Oh, save! Bahar runs is bathing in a big lead here. Doesn't have to do much in his end either. Not many shots. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. And we get a whistle as the goaltender decides to hang on to this one. Teams are ready to go, and we're about moments away from puck drop. The Zephyrs win it. Unloads one! With possession along the wall. The Zephyrs carrying it along the blue line. And that's broken up. Makes the save, I think he got a foot on that one. Nice move by the goalie to get out close to the shooter. The Zephyrs ready to go on the attack. Let's save by the goalie. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. We'll get a face off after the puck stays covered up. Dismiss that chance. Puck is frozen and we'll get a face off. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Rocked him along the wall. Wow, did he finish that check off hard? He had him in the lights and he didn't let him out. Broken up. Back to the blue line. Oh, comes up with a stop. Picked up along the wall by Kim Lennox. Here he is in close. Denies him. They worked the puck into a scoring spot. Get a pretty good chance on goal. They just can't find a way to finish it off. They put the puck into the offensive end. From the left side, he moves it up ahead. The knockouts have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Slides it over with pace to Kippersoff. Faceoff coming up as the puck goes up and over the glass. Play ready to resume as everybody lines in for the faceoff. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. The Zephyrs gain possession in their own end. Oh. 
The knockouts gain possession along the wall. Kiprasov's got it along the boards. Here's a chance! And the puck dies with the trapper save. Through center along the wing. And the final seconds ticking away here in regulation. back underway. Sends the pass across the ice. The knockouts get a hold of the puck along the boards. Grabs possession. Puck. Handles it along the blue line. Puts it just wide of the net. Well, the goalie's not going to have to do much with that unless they dive way out of the net. That thing's a way wide of the cage. Looking to make something happen along the boards. And now it's grabbed by Burakovsky. Handles that one. Slick feed. Here's a short pass to Kippersov. Getting a little physical there with that collision. That's all she wrote from this one. Pārliecs no šu uzvaras šajā spēlē mūsu vadītāja komandai Zemgalai. Ja pirmā spēle bija tikai trīs vārtu spēle, tad šodien bija veseli deviņi vārti un diezgan daudz vārti kurbada vārtos. No principā pēc mūsu diviem iemestījiem vārtiem varēja jau secināt, ka spēlē būs daudz vārti, jo diezgan viegli šodien gāja ripas vārtos, nebija pat mums tik daudz metieni, bet ripas patiešām daudz gāja vārtos. Teikt, ka Argento Milbergšanim varbūt nebija pārāk gatavs. Kādi plusi šajā spēlē, ka izturējāmies mazākumu, vismaz neielaidām kā iepriekš šajā spēlē. Metiena efektivitāte mums bija ļoti laba. Tagad dodamies jau uz Jelgavas ledus hāli, jeb Zemgales mājas arēnu un tiekamies jau parīt uz trešās sērijas spēli.